Okay, YouTubers and everybody else, it's time to make that world famous chili, bison chili. So the first thing we got here is a pan of brown bison. Uh, give me one second here and I'll show you quick what I did with it. What I do when I brown it, I take some paper towels, tip the pan, and you render out a lot of that fat and crap, even though it's very lean to begin with. I like it totally lean. Anyway, in goes the beef, or the bison rather. The pan you can hear is already hot. I just uh, cooked up the egg noodles. We'll pop them in next. Give them a quick swirl around. We have one can each of black and brown beans, or black and white beans rather. Black and brown beans. Uh, the company, black and brown or something. Get rid of that bowl. And we got one can of white corn uh, rinsed, one can of yellow corn rinsed. One can of tomato sauce. You can hear this stuff cooking already. It's so hot in there. Give me a quick stir. Uh, I like to let the, the bison hit the bottom of the pan first. Let that kind of flavor it so everything else will come across better. Uh, diced uh, tomatoes with chilies. And a little can of tomato paste. I have it on good authority. It adds nice flavor. Oh, if you can have a can. <laughs> uh, one second here. Remember my mom telling me, put the knife in and turn the can. That's all you got to do. <laughs> uh, I used to cook with my mom a lot on rainy days when I couldn't be out playing. They got to be rinsed. Then the final ingredients. Uh, uh, bushes. They're, I, they're, I use bushes for all the black and the white. The black and the white I rinsed. This one I'm not. Uh, it says a hot chili sauce, so we're going to find out. The final ingredient I use is this. You can use any of them. I'm sure a lot of companies make a good one. But the trick is to have this stuff stirring when you're putting it in. So mix all these things up good, then you sprinkle some, stir it, sprinkle a little more, stir it, get rid of the rest, get it all in there, then you want to stir it up good. water. Now Wendy's, I'm not making a soup chili. I'm making a thick, rich chili. And you can put it on a bison burger. <laughs> and then you'll have the best meal. Bison burger with bison chili on top. A little cheddar cheese to finish it. Good to go. Here's the recipe. Enjoy.